Recently, there's been a massive surge of a seemingly new Warzone mechanic making its way into the spotlight. This mechanic isn't new, and in fact has been in the game since Warzone 3 released on December 6th last year. But what is this mechanic, and why is it so overpowered? Especially to those on mouse and keyboard. Today, we're talking about Tax Dance. Tax Dance is defined by Activision as the perfect middle ground between hip fire and aiming down sights, and provides improved mobility speed and visibility to your regular aiming down sights mechanic. For dummies, you're basically able to aim more consistently in close quarters combat while also moving with an increased trace speed as opposed to your normal shooting. To turn Tax Dance on with any gun, except for snipers from my knowledge, just aim down your sights in melee. For me, that's right click in V. If you're on controller, that should be left trigger and down on the D-pad, but don't quote me on that one. Popular mouse and keyboard Warzone player and leaderboard grinder Metaphor actually brought Tax Dance into the limelight during the Season 2 update when the BP-50 AR was released. With this specific BP-50 build shown here, it was apparent that Tax Dance could be broken depending on what gun you used it with. This newfound love for the Tax Dance mechanic has led to some insane builds that proved to be incredible for mouse and keyboard players and controller players alike. There's a couple reasons why mouse and keyboard players would find tax dance more rewarding than actually aiming down their sights. Firstly, it's incredibly easy and consistent to track your opponents, as opposed to using the janky sights and bad iron sights that hide enemy movement, your field of view is always clear, allowing your bullets to find their targets easier. In the last 7 days of using tax dance, I've noticed that I rarely lose close quarters combat fights even against good control players, and find that if I do lose a fight, it's normally because of myself. Secondly, you don't have to waste an attachment on an optic. Ever since Warzone 2 released back in November 2022, every single submachine gun was so far away from what we experienced with Warzone 1. The guns in Warzone 2 just felt inconsistent, bouncy, blurry, shaky, synonym, 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 you name it. The guns just felt bad. Since then, it's become incredibly hard to see your opponents with an SMG without an optic, especially on mouse and keyboard. With Tax Dance, you could save that fifth attachment slot previously used for the optic for an attachment that better suits your needs. Lastly, it's incredibly versatile. If you're inside of a building taking an intense fight, you could be Tax Dancing and dancing around your opponents with ease. But on the other hand, if you've already cleared up that building and may need to shoot at some further targets, you can always switch back to your regular aiming down sights. Upon the release of Warzone 3, it was so easy to overlook Tax Dance as a fun mechanic, and not necessarily something that could be actually useful. The truth is, it's literally better than aiming down your sights most of the time, and it's incredibly accurate even at range with the right build. I've provided the BP-50 and TAC Evolver Tax Dance builds, but what if you want your own? The number one thing to keep in mind when making your own Tax Dance build is Gun Kick Control and Tax Dance Spread. Vertical and horizontal recoil is also a factor as well, but prioritize the first two. You'll notice that most rear grip options have a rear grip specifically for tax stance, which is normally the right move when making your own build. The less tax stance spread and gun can control, the better. If you're looking for more updated and complete builds for tax stance, feel free to head over to my Twitch where I stream my gameplay live every single day and have all of my builds updated. On another note, the love that you guys have been showing me over here on the YouTube channel has been amazing. I really do love producing content and my favorite genre is and will always be informational style. Not to say I won't post cool gameplays or tournament plays, but I love to talk about the things that I love. And I really do appreciate you for making it to the end. Do let me know what you think down below about this style of video, however. With the rest of the gameplay to go, I hope you learned something useful regarding Tax Dance, and make sure to drop a like as it really helps me understand what you guys prefer. And until next time, peace. You're almost done here. Midnight, UAV is exiting the AO. You have a buy station inbound. The recon trail is buy station is available.
squad members are in the safe zone. Need recon, overhead! Got to left. Enemy mark. Exiting primary objective complete. Good work.